My thoughts on AMC and GME or GameStop. It's here again. Should you get invested? This recording is from a live stream and I go deep on the TA, my price targets, where I would be looking to make a move if at all and what I would do if I was you. Obviously, none of this is financial advice. Enjoy the video. Who had AMC and GME on their radar uh, four days ago? Anybody? Anybody? Was anybody like, ah, you know what? Like who actually did a 5X? So GME has done a 5X. Who in the chat actually bought this or went long at $10? Who did that? Let me know. Listen, I'm gonna keep it real with you. This is super overbought. Let me say it again, cause I don't think you heard me. This is super overbought and at some point is going to crash back down. If you want to play a game of musical chairs, I hope you win. I hope you win. This is very overbought. 97.14 on the RSI. This thing is going to crash very hard. This is the same level that the RSI was at at the literal top in 2021 and we were at the 0.5 which is a huge massive massive level especially in stocks so listen if you're playing the game of musical chairs i hope you win but understand you're playing with fire if you were to make a play on this i would wait for a back test of the 236 at like 34 dollars. i would not touch this here this is super over bot it sort of broke trend like this chart overall in the macro doesn't look too bad to me honestly if we're if we're talking about like macro charts this chart doesn't look too bad we're at a super technical level and it's super overbought right now micro this thing is going to crash sooner or later like it's on the clock tick 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 i don't know when this is going to happen like we went to the 0.5 got rejected hey ay, ay, ay. come on now the, the the quicker you zoom the more you zoom in the more it's like oh right so macro the chart doesn't look bad in the micro though this is extremely overbought extreme not like a little bit not like oh a lot not extreme and i'm gonna ask you like who had gme on the radar a week ago who who amongst you who who went long a week ago because listen, like I'm gonna keep it real with you. I'm gonna keep it real. And I talked about this. I just talked about this earlier. At the bottom of Bitcoin, 26 or 20, uh, 2022, when FTX went to zero and Bitcoin was at 16K, people in my real life went out of their way to approach me and say, nah, 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 boo boo, stick your face in doo doo, Bitcoin sucks. <laughs> right? That's not exactly what they said. I'm paraphrasing a little bit, but that's basically what they said, right? And it was super popular to be like, ah, it's going to 12K, it's going to 10K, right? Listen, in my real life, two days ago, people were asking me about GME that have not invested for like four years. All right? That's all I'm going to say. Listen. I could easily be wrong, right? I've been wrong before. I hope I'm wrong. I hope I'm wrong for all of you guys. I am pointing out the fact that in my real life, people went out of their way to tell me about GME. That's all I'm saying. Just like people went out of their way in my real life to tell me how, uh, how much Bitcoin sucked. So I hope that I'm wrong for all of your guys' sake. Truly, I do. Because I don't have a I don't have a dog in this fight, but I'm just showing you I'm just sharing what I see intuitively as well as technically. And I know for a fact it is the talk of the town. Every single TikTok creator is talking about GME. Everyone, everyone, everyone's talking about it. It's the talk of the town. It's all over everywhere. Everyone's talking about it. I haven't had this many people talk about it in my comments since 2021 hopefully i'm wrong even cnbc and all the business television channels are talking yeah exactly 
exactly oh uh, that's the sign yeah like listen this is hot like just straight up technically if this were like take gme out of it take gme out of it if this was a cryptocurrency and i'm seeing this right here like sell 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 all right let's look at gme on solana since everyone's like oh it's different different over here bro all right let's see is it is it though let's see We'll see about that. 131 million dollars. Yep. Just straight line. You're good, bro. Straight line up. That's how the stuff goes. It's just going to keep going forever. Don't worry. Just get on now while you still can. Obviously, I'm being sarcastic. <laughs> no. Yes. This is oversold, too. Overbought, too. All right. I'm going to keep it a buck with you. This could go another uh, 22%. In all likelihood, if it wants to go crazy, we got another 1.5x. 22% to 1.5x? Bro, come on, bro. Like, Bitcoin's going to do that. <laughs> Bitcoin will do that. Yeah, nah, bro. This ain't. And then, like, downside, downside though? Downside, though? Downside, though. Uh, 91%. So there you go. That that's your risk to reward. That's your risk to reward. 22% upside, 91% downside. Hopefully I'm wrong. Hopefully I'm wrong. I hope for like listen, I don't have a dog in the fight. I don't care. I'm just giving you my honest opinions. I hope that I'm wrong. I hope that I am. Truly. Truly, truly. Verily, verily, I say unto you, I hope that I am dead ass wrong for all of your sakes. Alright, in the process of recording this video and editing, uh we have some breaking news, and unfortunately for all the GameStop holders, I was in fact right. So when I was recording, when I was live, we were literally right here. I said we had 22% upside, and it turns out we, we went an additional 10% to the upside, and now we have crashed from the top to where we're at right now, and it looks like it's still falling, 53% percent and the same thing is true on the stock gme we're down 43 percent from when i was recording that and we're actually back at the level where i'm like okay this is not a, a bad play at 30 dollars um not that i'm going to play it but uh this is what i anticipated a back test too so unfortunately for the gamestop holders i was in fact correct